Hello everybody and welcome. This is King Gamer and thank you so much for joining me today. We're going to play Age of Civilizations 2, so let's jump straight into the video. Hello everybody, so here we are, we're going to start a new series and by request we're going to play Slovenia in the modern world map. Um, the options are going to be the usual ones, difficulty, normal, and a, a aggressiveness, 125%. Right, Slovenia is going to be quite a difficult game. Um, it says here difficulty level 69%. We're just a three province country and we're surrounded by much bigger nations. Our plan is going to be obviously, of course, we'll try to form Yugoslavia to start with. And after that, our target would be to recreate the um, Warsaw Pact. So we're going to aim to have Bulgaria, Romania, Moldova, Hungary, Czechoslovakia, Poland. We'll get the Baltic countries as well, Estonia, Latvia, Lithuania. And we'll get Belarus and Ukraine. We will not go into war with Russia if we can avoid it. Right, so uh, let's crack on and see how we get on. And we start by allocating our technology points, which is going to be primarily taxation. Uh, although we're going to put quite a few sort of military upkeep. Let's go taxation maximum. Military upkeep, also quite a lot. Then just the three points to economic population growth, and this one put on income production. Right, and our budget, we're making a very small budget surplus, so we need to raise that to the maximum. Now, let me see what's the happiness of our population 78%. You know what? I think we're going to do. We're going to go over up to 1% um, happiness per turn. And we're going to do that for about four or five turns just to maximize our chances to, to get money to, for our armies. We're going to reduce the goods and the investments to the minimum. And based on these, we have 365 gold per turn. Well, our main target initially is going to be Croatia um, because it's our, the smallest of our neighbours. We've got three provinces, so Croatia's got seven, Hungary ten, Austria eleven, and obviously Italy many, many more. Right, so my main target is going to be to improve relations with Italy because it's our most powerful neighbour. So we're going to improve relations with them and we're going to roll a couple of turns. Now this is turn three, so I think we're going to we're going to get some loans, because otherwise I don't think we'll manage to survive. Take the maximum loans we can. There will be five loans. So that was one, two, three, four, and five. So we go another turn. Turn four. We're going to build our armies now. We're going to reduce. We're going to reduce our taxes now because otherwise our people will go very, very unhappy. So we'll keep it just there, just sticking over slightly over to the positive. Our yeah, our um, happiness is still seventy-five percent. So that's okay. Right. So we've got ten thousand to play with. So we're going to recruit, and if we do. A thousand in this province and the rest. Right, let's go and declare war on Croatia. And hopefully I'm going to send a few to that province Pula. And the rest are going to go to Richika. And then everything else is going to go to Zagreb. Because obviously they've got a fortress so it's going to be a lot harder to... Uh, to defeat. Right, so let's go for it.
Right, we're doing well in Sagre, but obviously we've got those there to worry about. So what we're going to do is we're going to try and protect Ljubljana, maybe with um, a thousand men. Hopefully they will crash against my fortress and die. These ones are going to go there, it's going to be about 800. The rest are going to go here. And then this 50 will try to take that province. Right, so let's see what happens. Okay, that was a success. And that's not quite, that's a shame, by very little. By very little. Right, so we're going to leave this 1,000 here. Um, see if we can defeat the other two provinces. And I'm going to send just a few, maybe just, um, say, 20, say, 19 to that province, hoping that they will... Oh, no, they had... Right, let's, let's send about 30. They had about 17 there. Uh, let's see if that makes does the job and these ones will try to defend but hopefully they will crash against my fortress there right they did which is good okay so I need to get those reinforcements back um, and I really want to stop them from um, taking Zagreb, so I'm going to just recover a few on my province there because I don't think they've got very many and then I'm going to try and kill that stack with my 900 didn't manage that but okay big army's gone um, right so I think that's going to go back to Zagreb Let's send a few there, see if we can kill that stack in our province and stop them from get, getting into Ljubljana and the rest will try to get that province split. Okay, okay that went well. Now that's going to go to Ljubljana. Um, now let's see, uh, we need to, that's Croatia, so we need to get to the port and let's see, see if there's anybody there in that province. There was. I'm hoping that this will, we're going to send them there. I'm just going to take them there. Okay. So we just need to get the province. We're back in the profit now, so that's good. Um, let's, say, let's send some troops over to the sea that can go from here. And hopefully I'll be able to take the rock Nick in the next turn. I don't think they've got very many um, very many troops so I'm hoping that these troops will actually manage. Let's see if we can land there and then these troops will go there as reinforcements just in case. Right, okay, so we've got 100% victory, so let's see what we can get from them. We certainly won Zagreb, Richika, um, and we can get Virovitka and Split. Yeah, I think that's all we can get, so that's good for me. I'm going to send my demands. And they've agreed. 
Now they've got just three provinces that which are like s separated. So I think I think they'll be able to take on at the next turn. Right. Let's watch our diplomacy. Italy uh, is neutral to us, and Austria oh, doesn't like us. Hungary minus six, and obviously Bosnia Herzegovina. Minus two. That's okay. I think we're probably we're probably doing relatively well. I think Italy is our main main ally um, that we want to get. Right, let's um, assimilate. We can only do a few turns each turn. We're going to do fifteen first, because otherwise we'll run out of money. We'll remove, um, we'll remove the simulation turns of the game because they're boring and they really they don't get us anywhere with these. So um, we'll start again when, we, when we've got some action. Right, we have repaid our loans and the simulation is going well. We're making healthy profit. Our diplomat has ended improving relations with Italy. It's plus eight. I think we're going to carry on. We really want to be friendly with them. They are our main, our main target for an alliance. And we'll carry on assimilating. And we're going to save our money now because we want, as soon as the truce with Croatia finishes, we want to attack them. Now let's have a look. Croatia, we've got 14 turns to attack. Maybe, maybe we should get Bosnia first. Maybe we should get Bosnia first. I think we've got Croatia, we've got 12 turns. We've got 14,000 in the bank. And we can take some loans. Our loans would be now for 2,000, so there would be another 10,000 for our five loans. It's 24,000 gold. I think that may be enough to crush Bosnia, but I'm going to give myself two more turns because we still have 10 left for Croatia after that and that will allow us to attack Dubrovnik more easily if we've got the um, Bosnia provinces. So let's do another two turns. We're going to take our loans. Loan number one, number two, number three, that's four and that's five. Right, so we're going to move our armies into position, so we're going to move those into Zagreb. And now we're going to build our armies here. So we've got 27,000, we can recruit 6,000 there, 6,000 gold equivalent. We can get 7,000 gold there, 5 Right, so we still have got some money left, um, but we can't recruit any more. So let's do that next turn. We'll do the rest in Zagreb. That will be all our money gone. So right, so we've got we've got seven turns for Croatia. So we're going to attack Bosnia. Really sorry, Bosnia, but we need to make sure that's going to go in here. We're going to take as many provinces as we can in the first turn, if possible. So um, let's see how we get on. That's good, they've attacked me, which means they have lost quite a few troops. Right, so we've got weak, um, we've got weak armies in the front, but we've got a big stack here. So um, I think we're going to send half and half just to make sure There's something like 18, 1900 either side. These two are going to send, this is going to send a few troops there hoping that there's nobody in Trebrinji. And then these two are going to go well, that's going to send a few there to 
Sapna. Just to try our luck. And then everything else is going to go to the capital. Right, so let's see how we get on. That is the problem. 800 there. That was a success. That wasn't quite what it should. Right. So um, our, um, our, our target really is to get the province. So I think we're going to send everybody there. And we're going to send 500, 600 there. Maybe 500. Let's leave a thousand behind, more or less. And then, um, I think I'm going to leave those there. Um, because they'll probably attack, I don't want them to break through. Right, okay, so we need to defend, but we need to get that stack, we need to get those two stacks. I think I may just send a few. Maybe we could send 60 there. And 60 there. And we've got, I'm going to split them in half. 800, 900 each. So let's see if that works. 900 there. And then 100 to, to bring J. That was a success. And that was a success. Right, so we've got 100%. So now we need to negotiate our peace. And we certainly want those two provinces because we want access to the Rognik easily. We want Trusla. But we can't. If we get. Right. So that's, that's all we can get. We've got two score left, but mm, that's a shame. Yeah, that's a shame. We've got three, three fives, which is which is good. Okay, so we'll see. Now can we get more reparations? Yeah, we can get more reparations for our two points. So we'll get a bit of money back, and we've sued for peace, right? Now, Croatia, two turns before we can declare war. Right, so I'm going to, uh, I'm going to split those armies. So I'm going to say I'm going to leave, I'm going to leave 400 behind. And then this one is going to go here. I'm going to position our armies to take Croatia. We need to recruit some armies soon, but we have to protect these three first. So we don't want it. They can attack in three provinces, so it's more difficult to defend. The army is going to see, but it shouldn't be going to see. So um, right, so that's going to go there in three turns. I'm going to send it here. Now that needs to go back there. Right, the truce has ended. So let's split that. I'm going to send 500 to Copa. And we're going to get... You see how many we can recruit in Zagreb? Yeah, we can get all our money there. Okay, so that's... Okay. Right, we're going to declare war against Croatia first. Right, let's see. I'm going to attack there. And these two will get Trebinje. If they escape through here, I won't care too much because that, we can get them back. Um, I don't know how many troops he'll have in the capital there, Pula. So I'm going to leave a few behind in Zagreb. In case, I don't know whether I'll have to go back to Ljubljana to defend. So I'm going to send, say, just the 500 there. And we can recruit a few more here. 
in case there's a sneak attack. Yeah, that was a big army there. Um, that was okay. And they crashed. Right, okay. So I'm not going to be too worried about that. The main target is to stop them from recruiting. So I'm going to go into Ossijek completely. These ones are going to go there to stop that stack. We're going to try and get those if we can, so it's no harm trying. I think we can assume that Copa is going to fall. But we've got a bit of money, so we'll recruit a few there, see if we can maximize the defenses um, that they have there. Yeah, we got that stack. Lost that province, but that's okay. That's okay. Right, okay, so that's going to defend. Now that's going to stay there. And we're going to um, going to recruit a few more here. Hopefully they will send some troops down here. And then these ones are going to go to Ljubljana. That's a shame. Ah, that's okay. Okay. 275. So this will protect that. This will protect that. Hopefully this will kill the stack. And I think we can afford to go full blast there. Yeah, that got killed. That's a success. In Croatia's time it looks. But we move troops in position just in case. Yeah, okay. So we've got 100% again. So we're going to get everything that was left. The three provinces. So we've got our three provinces. Send the demands. Now we're going to have a job. Yeah, we've got peace. Now we have a job with assimilation, but we're making good profit. So we're going to send all the troops. Well, most of the troops to Ljubljana and the other one to Zagreb. I'm going to start assimilating. Right, war reparations paid by Herzegovina, Bosnia and Italy. We finished improving relations with Italy. They sort of like us now, plus 15. Will they give me an alliance? Ooh, not yet, but it's not out of the question. It could be soon. So we're going to carry on improving relations because we want a strong ally. So we have repaid our loans. Okay guys, we will leave it here. If you have enjoyed this video, please make sure that you like, subscribe and comment. As always, thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.